Yes, I see you. <laughs> Get your big ass out of there. He's watching me. Um, it is 2.47 p.m. and we just got faced and it turned off. Now I'm going to go downstairs in the garage and flip the, the switch in the, on the breaker box and see if that takes care of it because this is a brand new microwave and we have not had it installed for a month yet. And this sucker turned off. I used it to heat something up on three minutes. And the sucker turned off. So let's see what happens. I'm not playing this game. Okay, we had American Home Shield. And they're garbage, in my opinion. But um we had an issue with our microwave and we took care of it. You know, they, you know, it took them about a month to get us a microwave. I don't understand why. Anyway, the sucker just went off, like completely turned off. Like this is a brand new microwave. They just came and installed not even a month ago today. And I heated something up and it's off. No, I am. So let's go check the breaker, circuit breaker, and see what's going on. I'm in the garage. All right. Because this game, I'm not playing. Um, microwave, microwave. Okay, right here. Microwave. I'm going to turn it off, turn it back on. Let's go see. All right, so let's, okay, it's back on. Listen, I did not, I didn't want to have to call them folks. All right, it's back on. Okay, I did not want to have to call them folks and cuss them out again. Yeah, they're garbage. Um, American Home Shield, I would not recommend them. You had to go through too many, way too many hoops to get the service that you're paying for. And we had the highest tier because we purchased the home and the appliances are new to the home, not new for us. So we figured, okay, let's make sure that if some shit go down, we'd be able to handle it. You know, we got, got the stuff protected. You pay $90 a month and a service fee of 125. So whenever someone has to come out, you have to pay 125 up front. Okay. But for the months that I, I guess for the months that nothing happens, you still got to pay $90 a month. I guess it's kind of like health insurance or car insurance. Even though you don't have an auto and you know, in a, a car accident, you still have to have that protection to make sure that, you know, it's, I don't know. Anyway, their service is garbage, but it was just a circuit breaker. I'm not going to use this microwave for about a day or so. I'm lying. I'm not going to use this microwave for about an hour. I'm going to make sure we straight, but crazy. Last day on the job, turning my ish in. Go get some breakfast. Go get some breakfast. So 
So I got my breakfast. So they waited until I'm ready to leave to give us better desks. Really? But anyway. Um, uh, I'm still training the person who is going to um, come after me. Who she actually already works here. But she's gaining my client. I bill. I'm a biller. And I bill for the largest client uh, that this firm has and um, I work for a law firm and um, so this is my last day I have not been in the office in three years and it's nostalgic I'm not gonna lie it's it's really nostalgic nostalgic going on because being in the office at first when when we were first working from home and the pandemic hit I didn't want to work from home. I figured home is too close to my bed and bed is where I want to be. But then the convenience of working home set in. And now that the convenience of home has set in, now that I come back just to bring my computer and stuff back, I miss being in the office, which is ironic because I'm getting ready to go to another office. But I'm here and I'm about to start training and I've shut I'm ready to shut everything down for the day and walk out of here and leave my badge leave my badge this is me three years ago come on here growth come on growth period anyway let me finish my day and um, I'll chat with y'all in a minute I thought that I would fix myself a refreshing glass of iced tea. Look at that. Whoo, glory to God. That sucker looks amazing. I was in the cafeteria. I said, hey, this coconut tea, is it good? Oh, yeah, it's real good. It's real good. Lies and deceit. This crap is garbage. I don't like it. Don't like it one bit. Coconut tea? I should have known. I should have known. Um, just continuing the vlog. So I have a lot of nothing going on this week. Um, I am in between jobs, meaning the last day on my previous job was Friday, August 25th. And I don't start the new one until after the holiday because I decided that I needed to take a week off just to relax, regroup, get myself together. <laughs> congestion anyway so I'm sitting here I woke up early as hell thinking I was sleeping the day away at seven o'clock and so now I'm just sitting here I don't have nothing to do it's weird coming downstairs and not going over to the dining room table to log into my computer and start work it's really weird because I've done that for five years but I'm gonna get over it by tomorrow I'm sure because I'm just sitting here, me and the dog, just sitting here relaxing. Um, I'm going to conclude the vlog this week. I just wanted to come on really quick and say hey there, hi there, ho there to you all out there. And um, thank you guys again so much for watching and um, rocking with me and my channel, my videos. Um, you guys are running up my shorts and I totally appreciate that. Keep running them up keep watching my videos because even though I have the subscriber amount I still don't have the um, watch hours so 
I'm over trying to make that happen. It's going to happen when it's supposed to happen. So, but again, I appreciate you guys. Um, oh, so much. I'm, mm, I'm feeling dry. I look dry. <laughs> Maybe I'm coming down with a cold. Oh, I got to go to the barbershop. Look at that. Look at it. Look at it. Boop. I go to the barbershop. I'm not going to schedule an appointment to get my, um, locks retwisted. I'm going to do it myself. And, um, I got to go to the store and buy work clothes because I've been working from home for the past three years. And the work clothes I do have are winter clothes and it's still summer, summer temperatures outside. It's cooling off, but still, I'm not trying to wear no wool suits and stuff like that to work. I look like anyway. Um, maybe I'll take you guys along, but that'll be in a different vlog. But again, I'm ending this one for the week. And um, again, thanks for rocking with me. Peace. To the next video. Peace. Don't forget to check out my husband's channel. His um, channel name is Monday Night. The man you love to hate. So, thank you. Bye. <laughs>